Native people, Native culture, Native knowledge. Hi, I'm Jeannie Green, bringing you award-winning Heartbeat Alaska. Bringing you national and international Native news, this is award-winning Heartbeat Alaska, the premier Native voice in Native programming. There's a heartbeat, loud as thunder, revolution is in the air. There's a heartbeat, deep inside our mother, are you too cool to care? Now, with Heartbeat Alaska, here's Jeannie Green. Hi, I'm Jeannie Green. Thank you so very much for joining us. Hello to all our good friends in Alaska. Thank you very, very much. I'm so glad you invited us into your home. And hello, Canada. Hello to all our good friends and reservations across the lower 48. And hello, Russian Far East. Heartbeat Alaska takes pride in introducing one culture to another. And today, thanks to our good friend, Robbie Romero, we travel to the lower 48. Robbie has now branched out into filmmaking, and thanks to this illustration called Hidden Medicine, he shows us his grave concern for nature. We travel Nome also today, thanks to Raymond Panyaktak, who sent video of Eskimo dancing in that area, and also backed by popular request, Athabascan Mark Brown. It's a great show, and I'll be back in just a moment. Heartbeat Alaska is sponsored in part by Chugach Alaska Corporation. The sponsors at Ikayo Koloko Heartbeat Alaska. Heartbeat Alaska welcomes its new sponsors. Welcome the Council of Athabascan Tribal Governments, serving the Yukon Flats for 15 years. Help us welcome one of our new sponsors, Wave Wholesale Company. Your one-stop supply source for village retail stores, food service customers, and government agencies. Welcome aboard, Wave. And by Reeve Aleutian Airlines, serving Alaskans for over 65 years. Thank you, Reeve Aleutian Airlines. Alaska is also brought to you by Alaska Village Electrical Cooperative, turning the lights on in rural Alaska. Heartbeat Alaska thanks Executive Suite Hotel, the official hotel for Heartbeat Alaska. When you come to Anchorage, please stop in and say hello. Thank you for sponsoring us, Executive Suite Hotel. And now for a real treat, a video produced and made by Robbie Romero, a good friend of ours here at Heartbeat Alaska, a good friend of the Earth's. He shares his concern for nature and the preservation of it through this wonderful video called Hidden Medicine. By the way, look for Robbie Romero to be coming to Alaska real soon. I had a dream. I'm not sure if I was awake or sleeping, but it lives in my memory.
months ago, I heard a voice speak my name. Renee, come, come. I will show you things that'll help the people. It was a strong voice, yet kind. We were given originally a way of life, a way to live in peace. And so the one that we call the peacemaker came among our people and gave this message for life, for all living things. So many, many people need to hear a message which would remind all of humanity that there is a way to live in peace on this earth rather than to be the dominant component of this great cycle of life. And the voice continued. The humans are following a path towards destruction for life on earth. And your brothers and sisters are leading everyone in this direction towards destruction. It said, follow the spirit guide. You will then be taken to the wisdom keepers. Tell them that they must do their best to change this direction, that they must challenge the consciousness which created this path towards suffering and tragedy. So it us, who will watch over us. It's why we need you. They're putting bad things into the air, and it is becoming hard for us to breathe. What are we going to do? We must listen to the words of our young people and their concerns if we are to survive as a people. In all of the instructions that we have received from the Creator, Everything is always in balance. The universe is in balance, and we should be in balance. The Creator made all colors of man and gave us all different instructions and placed us all in different parts of the world. And it is important that we help one another and love one another and to see that Mother Earth is protected. We have chosen you for the mission. We have chosen you to be the runner. We want you to carry this message to the industrial nations, and you will travel to the large city south, Anunu, where this United Nations is. We're going to depend on your legs and the strength of your body and the clarity of your mind to carry this message. We want you to carry this message for the future of our children. We will ask the Creator to assign the eagle to be your guide during the day and the stars to be your guide at night. This can get that. With this string, I want you to carry the warnings of our spiritual leaders. This can't get that. With this string, we thank the four protectors. We're asking to go with you on your journey, to look after you, to see that you carry your mission through and bring you safely back here with a message that's going to secure a peace and a well-being for the future, for the seventh generation coming, and for the welfare, the health, and the well-being of Itinoha, our Earth, our mother. And so now you have the message. And with all of our people here, we send with you our good wishes 
and our prayers that you travel safely and you return safely. And we shall wait for your return. Donato. Remind them that 95% of the plants and flowers have never been studied. Our future cures are being destroyed. Tell them the Earth has become sick with a great fever that is warming the planet, causing powerful hurricanes, tornadoes, floods, earthquakes, volcanoes, and big winds with deadly sicknesses. Remind these nations to tread lightly upon the earth, their mother, Can. for they are walking on the faces of their children.
Sister Moon, she lights our way. In the night of day I'm beginning to realize that I'm actually solar power, just, just like, like the, the trees. trees. But biology teaches that all living systems are related. Plants have been teaching me that everything is interconnected. So when I smell, when I taste, when I touch, when I hear, and when I feel, I'm really interpreting all nature, like a bee carrying a genetic code to serve his nature. Touch your beauty from the center of creation. The last stronghold I see the coming faces dying with mysteries untold I'm connected living soul on the planet. The trees, the earth, the plants, the other people. My emotions move me and my cells move. The wisdom of my body with molecules flowing, energy resonating to heal ourselves we need to combine modern science and ancient wisdom. I'm a scientist. I'm living through such a strange time. Touch your beauty There are thousands of things living here with me in this building. I don't understand all of this. I just know that I'm part of it. And it feels like I'm connected to everything. The sun comes through the building. The window is not just a window. It's not just glass. It's a living screen. The roof over my head doesn't just shelter me from the rain and from the sun. It's living. It's breathing. It changes with the seasons. It connects the building to the sky. It connects the building to the earth. This is not hard. We've been here the whole time. Why didn't I know that before? These are the buildings that the architects have to make. Well, our runner is home. The voice said to me, the cedar trees of the Northwest are gone. The sugar maples of the Northeast are dying from the top down. Thousands of species, Plants, flowers, and animals are being threatened with extinction. Renee, it said, who will speak for them? So, have you uh, completed the mission? And you didn't deliver the wampum. is being cut down thousands of acres daily and now less than five percent of the forest remain so we want to thank you and it wasn't your fault that you didn't complete the mission 
It was the ones that you were trying to speak to who wouldn't listen. It made me sad, and I felt lonely. And the voice continued. This is not the first time it's happened. The Hopis have told us that they've knocked on the door three, maybe four times. They've been refused. They have not given up. They continue to try. And we shall, too. My dream said, what industry calls resources are your relatives. Look for the hidden medicine. And so we will not give up. We would encourage one another, encourage everybody to keep on with the responsibility that was given to us as we were created and placed upon this earth with all of the rest of the living creation. And now, one of our favorites, back by popular demand. In fact, he debuted in Heartbeat Alaska just last week. But people call him and say, could we please hear him once more? Here he is, Athabascan Mark Brown. Let's travel north now, thanks to video from Raymond Banyakduk, Eskimo Dancing.
Wasn't this a wonderful show? I hope you enjoyed it. I sure enjoy your phone calls, 907-563-7440. And if you have news or information you'd like to share, all you have to do is give us a call here in Heartbeat, Alaska. I'll probably answer the phone, and I love getting your emails. Thank you, everyone, for your concern and your caring for that the program continue and that we share your village news. In fact, please get your camcorder out and share your news with the rest of Heartbeat, Alaska viewers. God bless every single one of you. Have a wonderful week, and I'll see you right here again next week.